This circuit is for a turbine engine ignition exciter system. This is an AC input system. We have 115 volts coming in AC and the first component that we come to is a noise filter. Now the inductors black out high frequencies, the capacitors black out low frequencies. Next we have a power transformer and then third in line we have a voltage doubler network. So we'll go back and see uh, what the current is doing through these components. First we do have 115 volt AC coming into the primary of our transformer. This is stepped up to about 2000 volts in the secondary and that will actually charge that capacitor at number 3 with 2000 volts. Now when the current goes the other way, because we have AC through that secondary, the voltage of the capacitor at 3 is added to the voltage of the transformer itself, the secondary, and so we come out with actual 4,000 volts of DC pulses at point 6 and 7. Now that voltage will charge the capacitor number 8 and that will charge it to 4,000 volts and this is a storage capacitor which and it will store energy for later. Now 9 and 12 are both voltage discharge tubes and they're glass tubes with gas. They have two points that are open until that gas ionizes. 9 will let the spark jump at 4,000 volts and this actually allows our capacitor at 11 to charge to 4,000 volts. This short pulse also will trigger our secondary of our transformer gives us 40,000 volts output of our secondary. This will ionize the gas in 12 and 13. 12 is a discharge tube like we said. When that happens that allows the capacitor at 8 to discharge through the secondary. So we're getting 40,000 volts plus the energy that was stored in 8 and this is going to prolong the spark that we see in 13 which is our igniter plug. So that energy that was stored in 8 discharges. This helps it to hold the spark longer. If you're wondering what 12 does, it isolates the circuit. Otherwise, the 4,000 volts that was in the capacitor at 8 would try to jump across the igniter plug. So we have 12 to isolate that part of the circuit. And then 11 helps to create a pulse through 10. Otherwise, the current would just be draining to ground. Everything inside the red square is our igniter box. And of course, 13, our igniter plug, will be out at the engine itself. Thanks for watching.